point blank, do no subliminal dissing When I listen, I can tell you never been on no mission Sticking to the script, don't care if I offend you Neighborhood crib, the marathon I look my competition, never seeing him I done trained my mind that I'm going You can tell by how I walk, talk, I'm a boss A east side millionaire, on me what you thought My life is a movie, they can't get close to me They mad cause they can't be, I'm everything that they wanna be Yeah It's nice with that puzzle, big shout out to my nigga SPI, Spotter Low You know I'm in the black box, had to come through, tap in, show love one time yeah, y'all make sure y'all subscribe. Stay tuned. All right. today, even though I'm back being consistent, I wasn't really going to do one today because I had something planned today. Shout out to Tiny Minutes from A-Tray Gangster because that's the uh, homie that went viral a week or two ago, uh, standing in the park just speaking his mind about what he desired to see happen between his section and the Rolling 60s. Um which everyone knows is one of the most notorious rivalries, one of the most, um, the longest standing, if not the longest standing crip on crip beef known to L.A. County. And it's one of the most dirty, dark ones, you know. And um, he made a statement, and apparently he has a voice that matters because everybody from everywhere can't jump on camera who nobody online has heard of as far as a personality. Everybody can't jump online, speak their mind about something that is so deep and but so far-fetched in concept based on history and make a wave like that. When, when, when you get the reaction that, that we generally got, it just speaks to let you know what type of status that voice holds amongst that community. So it caused me to repost it on my Instagram. I was impressed and interested like the majority of us. And you guys know right here on the um, platform, I explain how one of my comrades I grew up with from Track New, once he saw it on my Instagram that I had appreciated what Tiny Minutes had said. Y'all know I'm using his name casually now, and I didn't know it but the other time we spoke on him. But y'all know him. He's the homie now. We spoke on multiple times. However, um, I didn't know his name. So when I posted Tiny Minutes on my page from A-Track Gangster, the homie from Track New, I am just keep not naming him because I... Um, assume he perhaps would prefer to remain unnamed. He ain't no internet nigga, otherwise he'd have been on this thing. He used to rap way back in the day at bars too. Shout out to my luck. But anyway, Cuz got in my DM and just said like, oh, Cuz a real solid nigga when he seen him on my page. And he was like, I did fair time with him and I got a line on him. I'm like, yeah, well let him know I'm trying to tap in. I had already been in Minutes DM. And tried to invite him to come on the platform and kind of like expound and discuss what everybody heard him talk about. He hadn't responded. So the homie that got back at me, like, cuz said he with it, just getting his DM. And like I told you, I told him, like, I already did that. Try to Next thing I know, a couple days later, his number landed in my DM. We reached out. And as I was speaking to him on the phone, I was just letting him know, like, yeah, I understand what you said. It resonates. I appreciate it. A lot of people seem to do to do so and I'm like hey I want to invite you on the platform to you know further discuss it and expand and he was receptive to the idea and he suggested that we include someone from the opposite side from 60s and he let me know that he already had a rapport with certain reputable members when he said the names there were some of them names that pop off and the name that he suggested was one of them names that I don't personally have a rapport with personally I have spoken with them indirectly or directly once or indirectly once or twice through some just politic and she knit and I know it's a mutual respect but I don't have a rapport relationship with this certain individual that he suggested like well maybe you know I'm with it but maybe you should get wooty whoop and we can do wop wop I'm like mm, good idea but what about wooty wop and like I say these are people who haven't discussed this end of this discussion publicly so I'll leave them nameless so I suggested someone from 60 similar in reputation status, slightly older. Like, what about said individual? You think that would suffice? And he agreed, like, yeah, wooty woo. Let's wooty wop. So before I like put the homie on the spot, because I don't know how you think. Y'all don't understand that some of the most sensitive, sensitive relations out here in our culture, you know, known to the whole thing. So 
I didn't want to just, even though I know I have the rapport with this said individual, I could put them on the spot and click over. And whether they really with it or not, they know how to handle it like a gentleman and turn it down and decline. I still didn't take that liberty. What I did was I sent the video to him as if I, I don't know if you've ever seen it or not. And his response was like, I needed it to be, I agree. I'm like, cool. And I'm, so after he said he agreed, I come with, um, I invited him, da 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 He suggested da 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 I suggested you, would you be willing? And very shortly, we was on a three-way. They had a very amicable conversation. And they agreed to come on the platform. And it was scheduled for today at 1 p.m. And so for the better part of a week, that's been the plan. Understand, as um, recent as yesterday evening, we had text message confirmation that we were going to do this at the Street TV location. I ain't going to lie, I was kind of excited, pumped up. You know, the two yellow chairs you usually see uh, occupy the studio on facts with feelings that I sit in and my guests sit in. Whenever there's a third person, or when they see us on straight politicking, you see Alex sitting that off seat. I was going to sit in the off seat and allow these two reputable gentlemen to sit in the prime seats. And I was just going to basically allow them to have dialogue. And if there was a dry spot or the conversation needed to spark to continue going, I was formulating a few questions in my head that I could throw out there to keep the conversation going. But I was really actually eager to just see them have this dialogue, uh, you know, for us to experience and appreciate. However, and I respect it, salute to the Keyways. I got dressed. I was ready to go, about to leave to go to the location. I got a call from Menace and Ron Ron. And after deeper thought, a wiser mind combined, and maybe even with reference with other people that matter, decided, which I very much agree with now that they made it clear, at this point, this conversation is not built for the internet. And respectfully, they decided to thank me, but um, decline for, but decline my invitation. And I couldn't do nothing but understand exactly, you feel me, where they was coming from. And you know, hopefully, you know, you know, basically explain this is a lot of building, which makes a lot of sense. He spoke passionately from his heart. And we all know everybody on both sides is not just going to agree with one rider, one reputable from one side just saying this Martin Luther King type she knit. Even when it resonates with everybody hard, because believe you me, everybody that hears it, for some moment, some period of time, some degree, when you hear it, it goes through your brain, your spirit, and your whole DNA, your whole nervous system. It makes sense. But then, the way we've been programmed, experiences, this bullshit starts seeking in and it becomes a battle with what we all know makes sense and these other things we've chose to accept as our reality. And that's the battle we're challenged with winning in the majority of the minds so we can see the progress that both Tiny Menace, myself, a lot of Rolling Sixties, a lot of other um, a Trey gangsters, and a lot of other members from our culture would love to see parents. Even sometimes we hold on to this she knit, thinking we hold on to the honor of those that we lost. I tend to believe that a lot of those were still and probably are in the ancestral realm saying enough is enough, y'all. However, can't stop, won't stop, don't stop. The marijuana thon, the melanin thon, that's melanin. The melanin, the melanin thon, it all continues. TMC on my mama. mama. It's a beautiful thing when the chat all blue. Most people don't like that. That's all homies, fiend up the teenagers. I overlook my competition, never seeing him. I overlook my mind that I'm going. You could tell by how I walk, talk, I'm a boss. A East Side, and you're homie, what you thought? My life is a movie. 
It's P.I. Can't though. get close to me. Smokes they all cost though. They mad cause they can't be. They back in the they wanna be. Yeah. This time around, I ain't moving with a gang of homies. By my lonely, couple bad bitches hanging on me. For sure, sharpshooters on deck though. Will I ever let my foot up off these bitch niggas neck? No. Blue Billy getting blunted. Wonder how it come to that. Can't let a rat do me like they done my nigga Thundercat. Hey Mac, place nothing above my paper. Couple slugs for the haters, but I love my neighbors point blank. Do no subliminal dissing. When I listen, I can tell you never been on no mission. Sticking to the script, don't care if I offend you. Neighborhood crib, the marathon I overlook continue. my competition, never seeing him. I done train my mind that I'm going. You could tell by how I walk, talk, I'm a boss. A east side millionaire, hold me what you thought. My life is a movie. They can't get close to me. They mad cause they can't be. I'm everything that they wanna be. Yeah. On the east, the streets anticipate my new release. Legendary beast. Peace to Lil Tootie Reese. 97,000 in a day's work It hurt to read the paperwork We from the same turf Talking super turned up to make things worse Passed out passes in the past I take the blame first Go hard when I'm cleaning up the backyard Queer don't sound like a queen trying to act hard I represent the truth We don't play by the same rules There is no competition cause I can't lose Versus vicious, sell them like souvenirs Blue diamonds in my ear Hella fly, I overlook my again. competition, never seeing him I done train my mind that I'm going You could tell by how I walk, talk, I'm a boss A east side millionaire, hold me what you thought My life is a movie They can't get close to me They mad cause they can't be I'm everything that they wanna be, yeah Look here, the haters act like he don't know me one man gang, I don't need no homie On the sell these days, they don't even see them seldom On the money, who didn't touch more than me and Melvin? Anybody help them? Hell no, ho Straight line dollars, they'll dog dough SBI spot, can't never have it East side legend like A7 Magic Honcho hustle, plus see the bomb in the booth Counting coins like Chucky from Swan How the most easy with the ends gon' bow down all the clowning like this. I overlook my competition, clown. never seeing him. I done train my mind that I'm going. You could tell by how I walk, talk, I'm a boss. A east side millionaire, hold me what you thought. My life is a movie. They can't get close to me. They mad cause they can't be. I'm everything that they wanna be. Yeah. That's TMC available on all digital platforms. Go run that up on oh, my mama mama. Rest and precious, powerful peace to the Keyway Christ and to the Puto. My Lokes, three up top. Two on the thumb. Oh, my mama mama roller coaster. We're going to keep it moving, moving. Brian Pumper. Sniper with Net Puzzle. Big shout out to my nigga SPI, Spotter Low. You know, I'm in the black box. Had to come through, tap in, show love one time. Yeah, y'all make sure y'all subscribe. Stay tuned. All that. It was point blank. Do no subliminal dissing. When I listen, I can tell you never been on no mission. Sticking to the script. Don't care if I offend you. Neighborhood crib. The marathon. I overlook my competition. Never seeing him. I done train my mind that I'm going. You could tell by how I walk. Talk, I'm a boss, a east side millionaire, hold me what you thought My life is a movie, they can't get close to me They mad cause they can't be, I'm everything that they wanna be, yeah